If you haven't seen the video of the woman that's like 35 and she's saying, look, I didn't do the right things in life and now I'm here and I don't know what to do, you should watch it. Because I'm not one of those people that need to burn myself in order to learn from somebody else's scars. See, I see you have that scar and I see that doesn't work for you and I'm going to try to do everything I can to prevent myself from having that exact same scar. Because so many people have the same scar and, they, and nobody like talk to each other to figure it out. Well, I'm a listener and I also like to learn. So in being a pick me, I'm going to learn exactly what my man needs, exactly how he likes it, exactly how he wants it so that he keeps waking up and being like, this is who I got, who y'all got. Because this is my best friend, my life, my life partner, my wife, my child's mother multiple times over that's the life i want to live so you calling me a pick me because i know exactly what i want i'm honored i'm honored that you see that i want more for myself than to be out here and be a single mother and have to figure things out i respect a single mother because i was raised by one but that doesn't mean i gotta follow in her footsteps i learn from her mistakes i'm i'm, I'm a pick me how you want it babe how you like it what do you prefer and I, I, I expect that same respect back. I'm not saying I'm a servant. No. But I'm a pick me, baby. I, I want to get shows every single morning. Over and over and over again. Okay? Pick me. I like her logic and everything, but I wouldn't be fair if I didn't ask this question. As pretty as you are, how come you ain't been picked yet? Now, you're saying a lot of amazing things. You're saying a lot of things that I, I we love to hear. How come you ain't get picked yet as pretty as you are? Sounds like to me, because dudes be lined up for a woman that looks like you. I already know. Sounds like to me, you reject a lot of guys. So you want to be picked by a certain type of person for the most part. How someone as pretty and attractive as you, you don't have a man that wants you, that has. What I'm saying is many men want you. Most likely many good men, but they probably only make $50,000 a year, $60,000 a year. And that ain't good enough for probably you. So a lot of times I'm like, yo, you saying you want to be a pick me. That's cool. I know women be ridiculing other women for that. For that. But get picked. Go ahead and get picked then. It don't take that much to get picked as a woman, y'all. Just lower your standards. Women's standards should be, can he protect and provide? And provide means take care of the basic necessities. Protect means if, if some go in a situation happen, he's gonna be the one that's gonna he's gonna he'll he'll lay his life down for you. And he treats you with respect and he's a good man, he's a good father. That should be a uh, prerequisite, not two hundred not two hundred thousand a year. I don't know why more people don't talk about this. But as soon as you stack up five figures, ten thousand, fifteen, twenty thousand, the sooner life becomes a whole lot easier. The more that you can do, the more freely that you can move, the less you have to take from people. Everything is so much better once you save up five figures. So I don't, I don't care what you do, how you do it, how you get there. Your main goal should be to stack up five figures ASAP, as soon as possible. Thank me later. Shout out to Money Coach Vince for that amazing wisdom.